Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. As you guys saw from the title of today's video, I will be sharing everything that's in my diaper bag for my newborn. I feel like I'm pretty minimal when it comes to carrying stuff for my son. I don't know, maybe you'll disagree, but I feel like I keep things pretty minimalistic in this diaper bag. I just carry exactly what I need, nothing more, nothing less. The diaper bag itself is from the brand Mina Bay. It is a vegan leather, absolutely beautiful. I love I love how it feels. The vegan leather is so smooth and it's just so pretty. When I was looking for diaper bags, I knew that I wanted something that was stylish that didn't necessarily look like a diaper bag. This just looks like a pretty big backpack, which it is. It's so easy to carry and I just love it. Mina Bay did gift me this diaper bag, but they're not paying me to talk about it. They're not paying me to say how much I love it. They simply gifted it to me and all my opinions are 100% Honest and my own, I love this diaper bag. It is a little pricey, but I do think it's worth it since you'll have it for many years to come. And I plan to have more kids in the future, so I feel like I'm going to be using this diaper bag for a very long time. In the front pocket, I basically just have all of my stuff and things that I need. Obviously, when I carry my diaper bag, I don't want to carry a purse on top of it. Like, I am all about carrying as little as possible, so I keep all of my needs in the front pocket. I have my handy dandy wallet, of course. Then I have a little compact mirror. This one actually lights up, which I love. It is so bright, as you guys can see. Always need a handy dandy mirror with you. I also have a lip gloss, hand sanitizer. Can't leave the house without hand sanitizer. This is from the brand Honest, really like it. And then I have some hand cream. This is from the brand Necessaire, I believe is how you pronounce it. And then I also have lip balm, sunglasses, my keys, obviously. <laughs> and then these are reusable bamboo nursing pads. If you are breastfeeding, you need these because they're so easy to use. Obviously, you just put them inside your nursing bra and then and once it's time to clean them, all I have to do is throw them in the wash and they're good as new. They're so handy. My newborn is now seven weeks. He's almost no longer a newborn, which makes me so sad. But I've been using these since day one and they're still in great condition after many, many washes. So if you're breastfeeding, invest in these. They're also very affordable. I think they were like 10, 13 bucks. Instead of constantly buying disposable ones, you'll save yourself some money if you just go the reusable route. Not to mention you're helping the environment. Normally, I also also keep a water bottle but I don't have the water bottle with me but I don't leave my house without a water bottle because I'm always thirsty especially since I'm breastfeeding I always need a sip of water so just imagine a water bottle on the side there's actually two side pockets in this bag which is very helpful especially if you need multiple bottles baby bottles or water bottles whatever you need it's very handy to have two side pockets for that so once we open up the bag there's so much space in this thing which is so nice it's easier if I just hold the bag at this point. But I have a little silicon pacifier holder with pacifiers inside. This is very handy and it keeps the pacifiers nice and clean. Speaking of pacifiers, I also have pacifier and teether wipes. These have been very helpful because my son likes to yeet his pacifier from his mouth once he's done with it and it's always falling on the ground. And then I also have some boogie wipes obviously just regular wipes we actually only use diaper wipes when we're out and about when we're at home we only use a cloth with warm water sometimes soap when we change his diaper because every brand of wipes that we've tried have ended up giving our son diaper rashes so we just use a cloth with warm water at home but when we're out and about we use the wipes and then of course we have some diapers i only keep about four i think that's how many i have here I don't pack a ton of diapers we don't really go out for long periods of time we normally go out for maybe 30 minutes to an hour sometimes two hours unless we're doing like an all-day family thing but for a quick errand to like target or the grocery store or whatever it is I just like to pack four diapers we've been really lucky we haven't had any blowouts which is really nice I feel like everyone talks about blowouts with their newborns or their infants and knock on wood we've been pretty good in that front we do keep 
keep a little blankets with us just in case inside the car it's a little chilly with the AC or if we get in an Uber and the Uber driver has the AC blasting, we like to have a little blanket. We do live in Florida, so it's not like we use it all the time, but it's better to have it than not to have it. And then I also like to keep two burp cloths. These are actually from Amazon and I absolutely love them. They are so thick and so nice. They also wash really well. They haven't shrunk at all and we've been using these since literally day one. And they're just a really good size to just like throw over your shoulder and to prevent getting any spit up on you. And they're also really, really soft. So it's really nice to just wipe the spit off from his face and it's not like scratchy or anything. So highly recommend these and they're also super affordable. So I will have them linked down below for you guys. We also have two types of bombs. So we have, we have a diaper balm from the brand Earth Mama Organic. Both bombs are actually from the brand Earth Mama. We have a diaper balm from them and we also have a nipple butter from them. So the diaper balm is obviously for our son and then the nipple butter is for me. If you are breastfeeding, I highly recommend to buy this. I haven't been using it as much lately because I haven't had any issues with latching or anything like that. But in the first couple days, I definitely used this a lot. I would apply it right after breastfeeding Feeding. It definitely helped me from not having like cracked nipples or bleeding or anything like that So I highly highly recommend this nipple butter. It does what it says it does It's really nice and it's also safe so you don't have to worry about breastfeeding again after you apply it You don't have to worry about washing it off beforehand and then I also have two bibs My little one is the king of spitting up. So these are a necessity I just have two different size ones depending on what we need for that day and then i also have two little body suits like i said we haven't really experienced any blowouts which is really nice but he does spit up a lot and i hate leaving him in like dirty clothes so if we're out and about and he spits up time i like to have two little outfit changes just in case so he's nice and comfortable and doesn't have to be sitting in his own spit up you know i also like to carry this a little bag within my diaper bag i basically use it for dirty clothes or dirty diapers in case there's no like trash can near us when we change him out in public this came in handy during a trip that we took we took like a 48 hour trip to tallahassee florida which is three hours away from tampa where we live and this came in such good handy for dirty diapers and for dirty clothes so i highly recommend it you can literally just throw this in the wash after you sit i've washed it a couple times and it's still in great condition so if i can still find this i will link it down below but honestly you can use like any sort of mesh bag and be totally fine and i think that's it oh wait no we also keep a pair of socks which we don't really use socks all that much because like i said we live in florida and it's hella hot here especially now that summer has arrived but we like to carry a pair of socks just in case and then a pair of little mittens we don't really use mittens as much as we did like the first week of our son's life but sometimes he does scratch at his face so we just like to carry it with us just in case because you never know and i think that is pretty much everything that we carry in our diaper bag it is completely empty as i mentioned i am breastfeeding so there's really no need for me to bring like baby bottles or formula with us when we're out and about so i don't really pump i exclusively breastfeed but we do have baby bottles at home in case i do need to pump beforehand which i have done but if we're out and about, I'll just pop into the car and breastfeed him in the car. No biggie. But yeah, that's pretty much everything that we keep in our diaper bag. Let me know in the comments below what you keep in your diaper bag for your newborn. I would love to know. And that is pretty much it for today's video. Really hope you guys enjoyed watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.